Hey guys, and welcome to a new short video. So, in this video, here I have an iPod Touch 2nd Gen. And as you can see, let me just turn it on. It looks like sadness. And there's my dog in the background. Uh, so, I'm just gonna do a quick little drop test while my dog does his thing. So, yeah. Right here, by the way, uh, this, the digitizer doesn't work. It, it's cables ripped. And it has a small chip down here. That's about it. Alright, so side drop, three, two, one. My dog just got curious. Screen assembly popping out. Can get that back in. There we go. No cracks. And as far as I can see, some small scratches. Alright. Backside drop, three, two, one. Okay, that turned into a front one, I think. And the digitizer fell off. And it's still working. Okay, backside, three, two, one. There we go. Dent, some. Is it still working? Yes, it is. And my dog just decided to go do his thing. And he's trying to get me to go with him. Alright. And now the front... I got my dog to go back inside. And now for the front-facing drop, you can see the iPod's still on. You can kind of see the time. Okay, face drop. Three. Actually, I'll go to the smoothest part here. It's about right here. Three, two, one. It survived it. I'm actually quite surprised about that. I used to have one of these back in the day, and I cracked it within a week of having it. Now, as you can see, it's still fully lit. But I can't unlock it or do anything at all. Alright, now let's step it up to chest height. Side drop. Three, two, one. Uh, that. And by the way, this is like all bent out of shape. But scratch-wise, it's pretty okay. Alright, chest height, backdrop, 3, 2, 1. Again, digitizer fell out. Oh, I had it upside down. I'm done. Alright, and now chest height, face down, 3, 2, 1. Okay, that's cracked 100%. What? By the way, if this doesn't crack, I'll just whack it with a hammer until it is. Alright, head height, corner drop, 3, 2, 1. Okay, that was on its back. I can already see it didn't crack because the digitizer keeps flying out. Alright, let's try again. Corner drop, 3, 2, 1. Okay, that was more like it. Uh, uh, and it's still pretty good, and now there's the digitizer cable sticking out. Alright, backside, fa face, he head height, backside drop, 3, 2, 1. Okay, starting to get a bit scratched up. And now, does it still work? Yes. And now, finally, head height, face down. Three, two, one. Yeah, this is cracked. Yeah. It's not that bad, actually. This will work? Yeah. As you can see, it started from that little chip down here. I wonder if that wasn't there. Would it have cracked? Huh. And now, just for the memes, I'm going to step on this table and do a 10-foot drop. I'm probably not going to be able to do the side one, but the back and front, they're easy. All right, side drop, 3, 2, 1. Okay, let me just snap that back in. Um, I don't know if this line was already there. 
still working. All right. <clears throat> Backside. This is around like 10 feet or like 12. Three, two, one. Okay, that that's glass flying out. I'll pick that up or else my, my dog will leave that 100%. Starting to be able to see inside the iPod. How is the back though? A lot more scratched up. And yeah, will it still work though? Yes. The LCD is starting to bleed a bit, a bit more though. And finally, the one that will break it 100%. Actually, this kind of looks like my phone right now. Just a bit less cracked. Let's make it look exactly like my phone. Or even worse. That didn't look that bad. Okay, yeah, it was that bad. Still works, though. Nah. Ah, there we go. And now, I'm just gonna do a quick little, like, dent test to see how easy this thing dents. I know these iPods dent really easy, so let's see. With the back part of a screwdriver. We do have a pretty deep dent. I, don't, I doubt you will be able to see. And right here. Now with the front part. Light pressure. No dent with the back of it pretty hard. I wonder if it's because this table's flexible. I'll do it in this. Okay, no. Uh, the top bit has separated. Uh, this will be annoying to align. Oh, stop turning on, on like that. Is it still on? Yes, it's still on. I want to dent it real bad. Okay, that's... That's something. Yeah, right here you can see all the other dents. By the way, no, that's not my phone number. That's someone else's phone number. I got this on eBay a while back. Actually, let's do what a lot of replace replace places do. Let's scratch off their phone number. There, you can't read that at all now. Okay, now it looks like this. The video is over now.